Are we having fun yet? Yes, we are. Welcome to the kingdom. I'm Andy. And I got three more tips and tricks for you for help you to get around and satisfactory. So I thought I would um, like for movement and getting around this time. So let's say you're stuck way up here on top of something. This is this is uh, my simulated mountain. And um, I just not happen to have a jetpack. I don't have my jetpack with me. You are out and about. But you have either uh, rods and uh, plates with you or um, steel beams and steel pipes. I'm going to use steel beams and steel pipes just because I think it looks cooler. Um, but the best way to do it, and these are to get up and down. But I'm going to do the down because it's a little bit more dramatic this way. Um, I can't figure out that. So let's, let's, let's do this. So I jump. And all of a sudden, I'm good. Then you can come over here to where you know the ladder is, and you go down. So basically, it, it's an easy way of going up and down things, long distances. If you need to get a little extra help, and you're out and about, you have to have the right supplies. So basically, the only difference between using it like this and uh, the other version is they're just half as tall. So you'd ha I would have clicked twice as much before I, I was able to go over and go down. Or if you want to be able to go up, with, up, you do the same thing. You just build a whole bunch in a row and uh, everything like that. If you don't like the way that looks and uh, you want it a little bit better, that's okay. Come over here to logistics and uh, you do the conveyor pole stacker. Put it off to the side. Build it. And then you can just do the same thing. Building, going up. It just takes a little bit more of them. Um, and uh, the other one just it seems to take less materials to get higher or lower depending on which way you want to go that's the first tip it's a pretty good tip I think um, second tip let's go over here um, this one is for when you have found that thing that you wanted to build you wanted you wanted to you found that oil which is completely off in a nowhere near your base or any of your bases you want to be able to find out where it is well I'm gonna go over to something where I've actually done this um, it makes things so much easier so like for the example this right here I've made when I found that there was more oil back here so I made a hyper tube quick access so what you do is you you grab all the materials you need for hyper tubes and then you drag it along with you <laughs> And then after that, I usually um, start making it look nice. So, like, this is me starting to make it look nice um, for this particular thing. I haven't actually done it yet, but that's okay. But I am starting a new uh, uh, power thing in my live stream, which I will be doing uh, tomorrow. Um, and so I started this thing. I set it up into a location I can easily have access to. And I quickly, every so often, put something and ran out to my new build out here uh, you you build it and then you build um, you bring the power with you as well so I'll, I'll show you a little bit of how I do it once I get out here but this is me so I started a new thing and there I am I can quickly get out here I have a lot of power going out right here this is this is huge um, here let me let me uh, flex a little bit just a little bit as I think I'm going to hurt myself doing this, but whatever. See, look at all that power. Huge amount of power. As, uh, yeah, well, that's it right there. And uh, stop. Okay. So uh, basically, you, let's say you found something, and I want to go even further this direction. And I wanted to be able to see if I can quickly do it. Uh, and be able to uh, quickly be able to come back easy. Well, you start off really easy. Um grab some power from something I'll grab you and then you start off your pipe and then you get your pipeline well this is this is the wrong pipe this is the wrong pipe I'm sorry guys I am I'm, I'm okay okay hyper type support you you grab one of these and then you like drag this along with you and you just run along with it 
getting over to the thing you've already found. So this is good for when you found it already. So let's say it's up here in this, around this corner. I'm gonna use this as a temporary thing. So I click that, then I hit my seven, run back over here, click this, bring the power over, grab more, run up. I'm only gonna do two sections just so you guys can see this really easy. Um, And you go to sit there and you're like okay i can build right here oh i'm out of supplies oh this is terrible well it just so happens that i have an entrance right here and i'm going to power the entrance and i'm going to go back to where i was and it's really easy really simple and then you put an entrance on the other side and you can you know you can go really far as long as you built along the way you can go get more supplies and go on and it just i find it so easy to start remote bases and then figure out later do you want to you know make the that you know more permanent you can you can do all my tower thing i love towers i'm, I'm crazy like that or you can or you can then you know figure out how to get your rail system over there or figure out how to drive there easily it's all up to you at that point last tip last tip well unfortunately i have to run back um for this last tip this last tip i used uh, a couple days ago um, and I was, I was running around and <laughs> this, this entire thing has come apart because I was running around and I ran out of, uh, jump, jump juice. Um, and I was having trouble trying to get around, trying to get to where I needed to go. And I was being surrounded by, you know, mobs and, um, they're not usually a problem but they're starting to get a little bit more of a problem. So you're going to have to be more, more prepared. And I wasn't prepared at all, not even remotely prepared for this particular thing. And we're going to quickly, I'm sorry, but the mobs I know that are like fun to, to do this with, um, are over here. And, um, we're, it's, it's, it gives you breathing room. It's basically a tip to give you some breathing room so that you can, uh, figure out what you want to do next. So I have some mobs. They're usually right over there. There's usually a grouping of them, um, uh, like three or four spitters. And once in a while, there's uh, some warhogs that like push you. Let's uh, let's run. And uh, so you're going along, and you are trying to get at something. You're trying to get something I like when I used it before I was trying to get a hard drive not this particular hard drive but I used it again at this particular hard drive um, I was trying to get at another hard drive and um, I was trying to figure it out and I kept having to hide so you got these guys over here and um, I did the the temp set there but there's a whole bunch of them and you're like ooh, what am I gonna do well run around carrying one of these I know you're talking about why why would I want to carry around this? It doesn't do anything to help me with all these mobs. Well, maybe it can. So I'm running around and these guys start attacking me. Well you throw it down quickly. Dodge, dodge, and get in. All of a sudden, they don't care about you anymore. You have reprieve. You can you can like slowly then run away and not have to worry about stuff. It's just, it's not something huge, but um, I, I can tell you right now, if you carry it, I know everyone's going to get the factory card really fast. And I'm telling you right now, around factories, that thing just runs so smoothly. But when you're out and about, carry it around with you too. Because if you get overwhelmed some mobs, you can uh, get a little reprieve. <laughs> and if I want to, I can slowly but surely, you know, get out of here. You just don't don't go full speed because if you go if you go full speed, and you try to do this thing, you're gonna you're gonna try to turn anyway. You just slide out. So just if you take it slow, you get away from the, and you can you know either figure out stuff or figure out how to build around the item you're trying to get, so that you can get to it. And those are your three tips. Hope you enjoyed them. Hope you guys have a great day. If you like what you saw, hit that like button. 
If you love what you saw, hit the subscribe button, and I will see you guys later. Thanks, you guys, for watching, and um, until next time, sayonara and ciao. See you guys later.